KETK News. You're watching East Texas Live. Welcome back to East Texas Live on KTK. Joining us now is Megan Riaz with Bethesda Health Clinic in Tyler. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Thanks awesome. for having me. Thank you for coming on. So, Megan, can you just tell us a little bit about Bethesda Health Clinic? Sure. So, Bethesda Clinic is a nonprofit medical and dental clinic here in Tyler. And our mission is to serve low income working East Texans who don't have health insurance. Okay, what services do you guys provide? So, um, we actually have a ton of services. We mainly focus on primary care. We want to make sure anyone in East Texas, if you're working and you can't afford health insurance, you shouldn't use the emergency room for primary care. Mm -hmm. You can come to Bethesda. So, anything that you can do, you know, the minor cold, or we also have a chronic disease program. We have a assistance with medication, we have women's health services, we have counseling, and then we also have a small um, access to specialty care mm -hmm. in addition to a full service dental clinic. So we have a lot of services that we're able to offer to the community. Wow, you guys really have it all. And that's a great option for people that maybe can't really afford to go to kind of a um, an emergency room, like you said, or right. can't really go to a um, primary care physician, like you were saying. Yeah, I mean, insurance is really expensive, and mm -hmm. Texas is actually the highest uninsured state in oh, our wow. nation. So it's really a problem, especially in Smith County. And we see anyone from East Texas at Bethesda. So you don't have to be in Smith County. You can be from Cherokee. You can be from anywhere as long as you can get to the clinic. And we also have uh, telehealth services available. Wow. So you can talk to a doctor, you know, on the phone or through a video chat. But yeah, we want to make sure people um, don't put their health at the bottom of the list. You know, everyone is thinking about health these days and we're trying to stay safe um, from COVID and take yeah. all the precautions, but you also should worry about your primary care health. And if you have, you know, some kind of ongoing condition or even if you feel like, you know, you need to speak with a counselor or you're having some anxiety and depression, you should never not go without because you feel like you can't afford it. Right. So, Megan, how can someone become a patient at Bethesda? So, it's really easy. You can go on our website. You can apply online. Um, and then at your first appointment, you just bring your information with you. So, we do ask for a few small documents just to confirm your income and things like that. But the copay is super affordable. And we call it a copay because we structure it like if you did have an insurance plan, how much would you pay? And our patients only pay $20 or $30 to see a physician. So, it's super affordable. It's great care and um, you can get an appointment within 24 hours so it's it's you don't have to wait a long time either and are there any requirements for people to become patients as well yes so we do have a certain requirements you have to be working a minimum number of hours it's not even really that many or you could be a student or a caregiver you have to be an adult um, over the age of 18 and then we just don't take any other medication I mean not a medication insurance policy so we don't take Medicare or Medicaid or anything like that we're totally for people who really would just have to self-pay and this sounds like something that you know people should definitely um, look into but maybe the compute the community can kind of take part in helping out are there volunteer opportunities yes so we have about 380 active volunteers at Bethesda obviously Tyler is a great medical community so we have a lot of doctors and especially doctors who say hey I see the need in our community I want to come volunteer so we're always open for medical professionals but we also have people people who come and scan documents. Um, we have a lady who comes in and, and washes our laundry. <laughs> um, we have admission volunteers and we also have volunteer opportunities at our two thrift stores that fund our mission. So there's, we can find a place for anyone. So regardless of your skills, come on in and, and we'll give you something to do. <laughs> well, fantastic. Yes. Thank you, Megan, for coming Thank in and so telling much. us a little bit about Bethesda. We really appreciate it. And guys, we'll be right back with the second half of KTK's East Texas Live in about two minutes. So 